Oh, hello there. What are we doing? Oh, just riding on sand dunes. Oh, I'm a hot mess, but check this out. I'm gonna fall. That looks so much fun. So we have a girls trip to Sedona, Arizona and just did a stop here at the sand dunes because it's so cool here. I've never been. I drove by when I was going to Phoenix, but I've never stopped. And I look like a hot mess because I woke up at 4.30 a.m. this morning. Check this out. We made it to Sedona and we're going on a hike today. We're going to be doing the Devil's Bridge Trail. I'm just waiting on the girls. Hi, girls. Hi, Liz. Hi. You guys excited? Yes. <laughs> know what's the best part about hiking? Drinking after. <laughs> Taking a break, hiding from the sun. <laughs> We're what? We're what, Nicole? You're funny. <laughs> She's single. <laughs> this place is so beautiful and it's so cool. It's our little hideaway spot right here. Power lifters who hike. <laughs> We're here, the Devil's Bridge. There's people lining up right there so that we can take photos over here. I'll, I'll cross it. <laughs> Nicole, who's dr jumped out of a plane with me, is afraid. Count me out on this one. Yeah. Really? Of that, Nicole? I used to, I used to jump out of Actually, you know what? I'm gonna do Bailey. it because I'm here. You're gonna do it because you're yeah, here. Yeah, but I'm gonna walk across. So no stopping, no take. Like, get my picture as I'm walking across. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Oh, yeah, that's kind of scary. Don't. I know what you're doing. I know what she's doing. <laughs> Melissa, get. Oh shit. I don't know. We're just chilling by the pool now. Our hike took like three and a half hours. I'm not sure if it was supposed to take that long, but we took a bunch of photos and enjoyed the scenery. Now I'm chilling with Sarah. She's like the only one awake. Both Kelly and Nicole are passed out and we're just drinking this guy right here. I was surprised that Sarah liked this. I wasn't sure. So I'm drinking, uh, taking my talents to Anaheim. It's a collaboration beer with Jay Wakefield and the brewery. It's a Imperial Berlin Weiss style ale with dragon fruit, passion fruit, lime juice, and Mineola tangerines. <laughs> it's got this really pretty color right here. Oh, and the bottle is like pretty much done. Actually, it is done. That was like the last pour. So this is the bottom of it. It has a tart nose to it and it's really, it is pretty fruity and I figured like for chilling by the pool, this one was a perfect beer to have. 
you do get a lot of that tropical fruit flavor to it and then also the tartness it's also really refreshing so we're just gonna chill by the pool for a bit until it's time for dinner what are we having for dinner tomorrow we're supposed to go horseback riding I'm so excited for that cuz I don't think I've ever been horseback riding yeah <laughs> so I was like what I, I rode a pony when I was like super young but never been on a horse there it's 2018 here can I open this Champagne. Cheers. It's time for dinner and we're at the Mesa Grill. The sun is setting. It's really cute out here. I'll show you around. Okay, I got the spinach and pork belly salad. Come on. Let me see if I can get some light on there. There we go. Oh wow. Is it good? It's really good actually. And a ginger drop margarita, but it's not really gingery and I really like ginger so I'm a bit disappointed in this one. Okay, we're sitting out by the fire enjoying our drinks. I don't know if I liked my salad very much. The bottom part was like super covered in dressing. The top part was pretty dry. There was a lot of fruit. I like fruit, but there was like too much fruit. This light just looks really weird. And then my ginger margarita. Not so much ginger in there. Did you guys like yours? Mine was a little too sweet. The margarita, how was your food? My food was decent. My Your crab, crab cake, cake sucks. So yeah. Nicole, how did you like $50. yours? Loved it. You loved it. Oh, you had the pasta. Oh, it was so good. So good. Yeah. Kelly, how did you like your dinner? How good? It was okay. My savory was really good. Oh, that's good. So yeah, I didn't like my margarita, and I'm pretty sure they didn't even give me the right one because it did not taste anything like ginger. But then I got one, and now I'm all good. Yeah. Day two in Sedona, we're hiking to Cathedral Rock, right in front of us. Apparently it has healing powers. <laughs> Tell me more about this, Nicole. <laughs> Tell me more about this vortex. <laughs> It is getting a little difficult going up this. It's pretty steep. <sighs> Wait, I lost my friends. <laughs> ah! I think we got to the challenging part of the hike. Oh. It has been one of the harder hikes I've done. But we still have all of that to go up. And I'm still out of breath. It was just like really challenging coming up from there. Oh, it's so adorable. We'll keep going down. Yeah, this is supposed to be a short hike. It's not that short. Nicole's the one who's been researching all the things that we're supposed to be doing, like the hikes. And she said this was a mile. I'm pretty sure this whole trail was way longer than a mile. I'm not sure if she meant like coming up to the top of yeah, no. Cathedral Rock well, or just like the whole thing. The hard part. Basically, it's not a mile long. It's super challenging. It's really beautiful. And I feel like 
I'm getting a really good workout. I'm like so out of breath right now. The view, however, is also breathtaking. We are done with that hike and all of us are exhausted. It's about one o'clock. We start at 10 and pretty sure it wasn't supposed to take that long. I think it only took us an hour to get back though. Yeah, it did only take us an hour to get back. We didn't take the right trail back, so we were unsure if we were gonna find the parking lot. Um, but I'm also sad to report that we didn't find the vortex and none of us are healed. <laughs> yeah, in fact, Nicole actually fell into a cactus and I also hit my leg on one too. So there's that. Did not get healed. Now we're gonna find some food. Oh, I'm sweaty. Nope, just pure, pure pain. But we're going horseback riding today. It, it, it just opens. I can't That's gonna be my first time. Yeah. Here, we're here. Look at the horses. I like a child right now. Oh. My first time going horseback riding. I'm so excited. How come this guy is just outside? How many total Ooh, horses did you guys have? You did, you did better than I did. <laughs> Richard, how many total horses you got on the road? It's out. We're just waiting on our Wrangler. I guess that's what it's called. He's called. I don't know. It's the first time I'm on a horse. Look at this guy. He's so good. <laughs> I I don't know what to say. I'm just like I can't believe I'm doing this. I've never been on a horse before. This guy is so cute. Hello. There you go, Queen. Come. How are you guys doing back there? We're good. Yeah. We're still on the horse. We're still on the horse. We're doing this. By the way, my horsey's name is Browdy. I think he's doing a great job. Oh, you got this, Rowdy. You got this. Of course you do. This is what you're trained to do. like sleepy. He's about to fall asleep. Good night, Rowdy. Thank you for the ride. Night, night. So that was my first horseback riding experience. That was quite enjoyable. What did you guys think of that? Oh, I love it. Sarah's a experienced rider. And she was yeah. saying how she thinks that the horses were really, really well taken care of. Yes, very much so. This is one of the best places I've ever had a trail ride. Honestly, as a beginner, it was really easy because my horse, Rowdy, just kind of followed the leader and I did nothing. I honestly didn't do much. The what? Um, the so about the famous on YouTube. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't really do much. I just sat on him like, and he, let, he, he did all the work. It was, um, it was a really cool experience and we got to just enjoy nature on a horse. I'm still like, I don't know, everyone in this car has been before. I've never been so it was such a great experience for me. I loved it.